up and welcome back to my channel. So in today's video, I'm going to be showing you guys what I got for Christmas. I'm so excited to be filming this video. I know a lot of you guys have been asking me in my comments and on Instagram to give you a whole haul of everything that I got. So that's what I'm going to be doing today and I cannot wait to show you everything I got. Before we get started, make sure you give this video a big thumbs up and subscribe down below and let's get started. Okay, so first we're going to start with my stocking. First we're going to start with my stocking. This is my stocking. Have it over here. Has my initial. And then, let's see, but I have something else that did not go in my stocking because it was too big. So first I got cotton candy. I got ring pops. I love ring pops. And there goes the ring pops. I got Fun Dip. I've been getting Fun Dip in my stocking since I was little and it's just always been a thing. So I love Fun Dip. Peanut M&M's. This is like about the only chocolate I will eat is peanut M&M's. I'm not a huge chocolate person. I love chocolate ice cream, but when it comes to like candy, chocolate is just not my favorite. The only chocolate I will eat is, like I said, the peanut M&M's because they're just, they're just so good. Like you can't beat them. And then also have been getting a nerd rope every year in my stocking since I was like literally born. Like I always got a nerd rope and it's just been a tradition. And every year I'm like, gotta get a nerd rope. I gotta get a nerd rope in my stocking. And every year I can pretty much count on there being a nerd rope in my stocking. <laughs> I also got this white chocolate like peppermint bark. It looks really good. Never had it before, but I'm curious to see how it is. I got some Christmas Sour Patch Kids. If you can tell, I love fruity candy. That is my favorite. I also got Christmas tree peeps. These are adorable, they're so cute. And then the rest of my stocking is literally filled with a million things of these peppermints. My grandma used to keep these peppermints in her house and they are so good. They're like my favorite ever. And so I got a ton of these in my stocking. And next we're going to start with clothes. There's a lot of clothes over here. That's the main thing I asked for this year and I definitely received. Um, it is like just piles of clothes. So we'll start with, I guess, Lulu stuff. So first I got shorts. They're just black shorts. These are actually the tracker shorts and I don't have these. And I'm really excited to see how they fit. I have not tried nothing on yet and it's been like a week since Christmas. But I just have not gotten around to trying any of this stuff on. After this video, I'm probably going to do that. I tried to wait because I wanted to go ahead and give a haul and finish all that first and then try everything on to see how it looks. So that's just what I wanted to do. So now after this video, I'm going to have to try all this stuff on and make sure it all fits and looks fine. But I got these. They're so cute. They're the tracker shorts. Never owned a pair of these. I own the Hottie Hots. And I actually got another pair of Hottie Hots. Where are they? I don't know where I put them. I literally just sat them over here somewhere. Hold on. Okay, I found the shorts. They're right here. These are the Hottie Hot shorts and they're in black as well. And now we're going to go into like actual sweaters and I got so many sweaters in here. And let me tell you guys, it was 30 degrees on Christmas and now it's like 70 outside. It's warm enough to wear like short sleeve shirts. And all this right here is sweaters. So <laughs> that's great, which I'm not complaining. I hate cold weather. I hate the cold, I hate winter. I love warm weather and I love the summer. So I'm not complaining, but I just got all these sweaters and now I like <laughs> the good thing is though some of them are thin so you can still wear them in like warmer weather which is not like hot but it's not like freezing cold either so I got this really pretty white sweater I love it it is so cute and I'm really excited to try it on and see how it looks I already have like a ton of jeans I compare this with and then I also got this black sweater which is really pretty as well and I love it um the only thing that like I'm confused about is the front <laughs> The front is like crisscross, but it's like really low crisscross. And I don't know really how to wear it. <laughs> um, I think I'm gonna have to wear a tank top underneath it because I don't even know, like, cause it's black, you guys can't, I mean, you can, yeah, okay, there we go. Look at like, like, it's gonna open up really wide, I think, on me. And then next, I'm in love with the sweater. Look at this, guys, how cute is that? I love the sweater. And I don't have anything in my closet this green color. I might have a tank top. That was a lie. I think I have like two tank tops that are in this color. But I don't think they're exactly this color. Maybe they are. I don't know. But I don't have any sweaters that are this color. And I just really think it's cute and I love it. And it's like cropped. And then next, I got these jackets, which I'm super excited about because in the winter and even in the summer, I love wearing like tank tops with jackets and then jeans. And in the summer, I love wearing tank tops with jean shorts and jackets. And it looks so good. So I got two different jackets. The first one is this one. It's like a cream color and it's just super cute and I think it'll look really good with some of the tank tops that I got for Christmas that are in here that you're gonna see in like two seconds. And then I also got another jacket which is literally the same thing except it is in black because I need like a black jacket 
like that's dress up and I need like a or dress dress up I mean dressy <laughs> I need like a black jacket that's dressy I have a black jacket but it's like casual it's not a dressy jacket and so I just needed a jacket that's dressy so I got this one and then another sweater I got is this really pretty cream color it's really funny because me my mom and my sister all got like the same color sweater I got this really pretty cream colored long sleeve shirt um let's see what's next oh okay we're getting into the tank tops I was telling you guys about first is this one it's like a black and white and I just love how it looks and I think it'll look really cute with some of the shoes that I got and I'm excited and then I also got this blue just plain tank top which is good for auditions because when i do auditions i have to wear a plain shirt you can't wear anything like with anything like this on like logos or like anything that's like really bold and is very flashy because it's like distracting so you have to wear a very plain shirt so this will be a really good audition shirt and just you know every other day shirt obviously oh my gosh i love this shirt okay i got a t-shirt and i'm so excited about it it's a rolling stones t-shirt and i just love how it looks and i love the print of the tongue Oh, it's so cute and I'm so excited about it. And then on Christmas Eve, my dad always gets us a Christmas Eve gift. And so for Christmas Eve, so for Christmas Eve, he got me this long sleeve vineyard vine shirt and it's so cute and the print on the back is so pretty and I love it. He did really good with the shirt, I'm not even gonna lie. Love it and then he did so good. And then I also got this long sleeve cropped black shirt. It's just like a shirt I wanted to wear with like sweatpants or jeans or you know just just something long sleeve and comfortable. I got this pair of American Eagle jeans. I just needed some new like dark blue jeans. I needed them so bad and I'm so excited I got them. I have a ton of other blue jeans in there that I need to get rid of because they're way too small and I don't ever wear them and so I just oh need a new pair so bad. I'm so glad I got them. And then I also got these jeans which I'm so excited about. Okay I went out of my comfort zone a lot when I told my parents I wanted these. I was like I don't know if I want them, but at the same time, I'm like, I really want them because I really want to try them. And I see other people wear them, and I'm like, they're so cute. And so I decided to get me a pair. And they're just these, like, tan jeans. And I love them. They have no rips or anything. They have a wide, like, bottom. So I decided to get these to go out of my comfort zone. And let's, fingers crossed, I like them. Because if I do, that's going to be amazing. And then I also got these sweatpants. I love the color of these. Don't have any sweatpants this color. I have gray and black. But I don't have any this color. And they're so cute. And then I also got another bag of Lulu. I got me some black leggings. Nothing fancy. Just some black leggings. Okay, and now I think I'm going to move on to jewelry. Because I also got quite a bit of jewelry this year. I think I'm going to start with the one my dad got me. Because he got me a cute little necklace on Christmas Eve. So it has a little dad and daughter in the middle of it and it says, I love you forever. And then there's a little card. And here is what it says. Pause it to read it if you want to. So cute and I love it. Next, my brother got me a pack of different rings. And then next I got, this is so cute. I got it from my sister. And those of you who do not know and don't follow with the family channel, um, my sister is pregnant and she is having a little girl and she is due very very soon And so I'm gonna be an aunt and she got me this bracelet, which is so cute. It's very simple But I love that it looks like this and this right here means aunt in Morse code I also got this other necklace, which I saw a ton of people got this year It is this necklace and it has a bee on it, which I love and then I also got another necklace inside of it And it's a paperclip necklace and then another Think of jewelry my brother got me these small round earrings and then i got this ring from my mom it is an anxiety ring i always like fiddle with my rings and my necklaces and when you put it on you can like roll this right here and it rolls it's so cute i love it and it's so pretty and now i think i'm gonna do what's in this bag because this is from my mother so first I got some body sprays from Bath & Body Works. This is a whole Bath & Body Works bag, by the way. So in here, I got two different perfumes. This one is my go-to. This is the one I use like every day and I love it and it smells so good. It's the Pure Wonder and it smells so good and it's my favorite. And then my mom also got me this one because she said it smelled really good. It's the Dream Bright one and it does. This one smells really good as well. I also got this candle. It's sugared snickerdoodle. And then I also got this hand cream, which is also sugared snickerdoodle. And then I got some hand sanitizer that is iced cinnamon roll scented. It smells really good. I was not sure how it was going to smell, but it smells so good. I love it. And then next I got a guitar stand for my sister. I have a guitar. I got it for my birthday this past year for my 16th birthday. I got a guitar 
and it's literally sitting right here in the corner of my room up against the wall and it keeps banging against the wall and banging against the wall every time I sit it down and it's literally just like sitting there like up against the wall so my mom was like you should get her that she needs it and I was like yeah girl I need that so bad so I got me a guitar stand and then on our beach trip this past year that we took there was a bunch of like different games throughout the house and this one right here was one of my favorites it looks very boring and very basic but it's actually so fun so you hang this on the wall it's called hook and you pretty much like it's self-explanatory honestly it has like your numbers or whatever throughout it and then you take the hook and you throw them on there and then whatever hook it lands on is the point you get and then like whoever gets the most hooks on there you add up your points and see who wins and it's actually so fun and i actually really like this game next my sister got me an iced coffee maker i'm so excited about this y'all have no idea i hate hot coffee honestly like it's just disgusting to me like i just cannot drink it but i love iced coffee and i'm all the time asking for iced coffee so i finally got my own little iced coffee maker and i'm so excited to use it I'm like ready to use it, I'm not even gonna lie. And then the next gift, I have to tell you guys inside joke or you're not gonna get it. So when I was younger, I had this little white dog and it was Peppermint and I loved it. It was like my baby and I literally walked it around everywhere I went. The whole thing was matted and it was turning brown. It was disgusting. But I really wanted to keep it and my mom's like, girl, we gotta get rid of that. Like you've gotta get rid of it. Like, mm, like mm -mm. And I was like, no, I'm not getting rid of it. And this was when I was younger, not now, when I was younger. And mom's like, you've got to get rid of it, look at it. And I'm like, I want it, it's mine, like, let me keep it. Well, one day I went to my grandma's house, and my mom got rid of it. While I was not home, she threw it in the trash can, and when I came home, I literally cried for days because it was gone. Yeah, I'm still to this day joking around with my mom about it. Peppermint came back. <laughs> and it's literally peppermint. She just has a pink bow this time. I also got some books this year for Christmas. Um, these books right here I saw all over TikTok and I heard that they were really good. So I was like, I want to try them. I did not realize they were as thick as they are. These books are huge. Like, I'm not even going to lie. They are gigantic. But I'm really excited to read them and I think they'll be really good. I heard really good things about them. So we'll just have to see how it goes. But I got, but I got Binding 13 and Keeping 13. These books are absolutely ginormous, <laughs> like they're huge, but it's all right. I get to take my time with them and read them and I'm super excited to start them. My sister got me this book. It's a journal, it's a My Reading Life journal and pretty much throughout it, you can just document like what you thought of your books and keep track of your books. So right here you can write like title, author, date read, you can rate the cover and then it tells you like what drew me to this cover and what didn't I like about the cover. You can write what you liked and did not like about the cover. And did reading this book change you in any way? What's your favorite passage from it? And just a way to like keep track of your books and write it down. And I really like this and I think it'll be really good. And I definitely will use it because I read so many books. Next, my brother got me this little holder and I can hang it on my wall and hold stuff on it like pocketbooks or anything like that or the two medals that I got. Um, it says she believed that she could so she did and it's just like a little holder and I can just hang it and then hold stuff on it. I really needed it for my room. I don't know where I'm putting it because I have nowhere to put it in my room, but I'm going to find somewhere to put it because it's, it's going to hang up somewhere. And I also need, I also have like some ideas for my room that I want to change. So if I change some of that stuff around, I can find a place for this to go. So yeah, we'll just have to like figure it out. <laughs> Next, I got this game. It's called Gib Gab. And is it upside down? No, it's not. Okay. The back's upside down, but this one's not. So, okay. Anyways, I got a game called Gib Gab. Not really sure how it works. I think I know how it works, but I'm not 100% sure it looks really fun it looks so fun and i'm actually really excited to play it it reminds me of another game that i saw and i really liked so i think this is i think this is gonna be the same okay here's how it works ready pick a category from one of the cards and then press the start button oh okay i got it I'm excited to play it i think it'll be fun next thing i got are a pack of makeup brushes i was so excited for this because my makeup brushes now are so rough and i've had them forever and they're just really bad and i'm using like the same makeup brushes for different products i'm using the same brush for my bronzer and my highlighter right now and that is disgusting and i needed a new brush so bad so i have some new ones and i'm so excited to use them and then i also got this makeup it's a highlight and contour stick looks like this and then i'll take it out so you guys can see it so this is the contour side. It just rolls up like lipstick. And then the highlight is so pretty and I'm so excited to use it and see how it works. Next, I got this rare beauty blush and I feel like a ton of people probably got this this year. 
it's a very hot item right now. But I really wanted it because I saw a bunch of like get ready with me's on TikTok. And so many people have this and it's so pretty. I don't know how it's gonna go. I'm not 100% sure, but it looks like this. And then you just like dot it on your face and it's your blush. And I hope it looks good. Okay, next I got this. I'm so excited for I'm in love with popcorn. If you didn't know, popcorn is my favorite snack. I can literally eat it breakfast, lunch, and dinner. Favorite thing in this world. One of the favorite things in this world. And I got a popcorn maker. This is actually the popcorn maker I used to have when I was younger, and it was my favorite popcorn maker ever, but it got ruined, and we had to throw it away. And I never got a new one, but now I have one, and I'm so excited. It's one of like the metal ones you put on the stove, and like you turn it. I am so freaking excited to have this back. Me and my sisters make popcorn in it all the time. And it's the best popcorn you will ever have. And then I also got this to go with it. It's flavor coal. This is what they use to season your popcorn at the movie theaters. And I've been wanting it because people say it tastes just like movie theater popcorn. So we're going to try it. I'm going to see how it tastes. Next, me and my brother got this together as like a joint gift. And I'm so freaking excited. We got tickets to the Carolina Hurricanes game versus New Jersey Devils. And... You guys don't understand how excited I am for it. So I went to the New Jersey Devils. Okay, we'll just start here. So I live in North Carolina. So these, this is my home state hockey team. Okay, this is, there's a guy on this team. I'm pretty sure if you know hockey, you know who he is. Jack Hughes. If you've not, go look him up. He is very fine. Not going to lie. He's beautiful and I love him. And I'm a huge fan. And I love Jack Hughes, but I also love our team because I love a ton of the guys on our team. And so it's like, mm, like they're playing against each other. Like, who do I cheer for? I need to cheer for my home state, but at the same time, like, you know what I'm saying? And then next, I got some shoes. So excited. Needed some new shoes so bad. The shoes I got, I'm in love with this year. I'm in love with my blazers. I wear my blazers every day. I just have like the regular black and white blazers. But this year I got these. They are white. Oh my gosh, it's so bright. Okay, there we go. It's white with the tan Nike symbol up here. Oh, I love these shoes. They're so cute and they're so pretty. They're so clean. Oh, I love these shoes so much. I love my blazers. I wear them all the time. So I'm literally going to wear these so much. And then another pair of Nikes I got are these really pretty shoes. I have never seen these before, but they're like bandana print and they're just so pretty. Like I love them. They're basic. They're not too much. Just what I would wear. And I'm so excited about them. How gorgeous are these shoes. You guys have no idea how freaking excited I am for these shoes right now. Like I've been wanting these for over a year now and I finally got them. I've been wanting them actually since my birthday, so not every year yet. I've wanted them since my birthday, I'm not gonna lie. I've wanted them since my birthday and I finally got them. I didn't know which color I wanted, but I'm in love with this color. It's very simple and basic, like me. But yeah, I finally got me a pair and I'm so happy. I also got a Barnes & Noble gift card. I forgot to show that earlier with the books, but. I got this Barnes & Noble gift card, and then now let's move on to my last and final gift, which I'm actually sitting on. This is my last and final gift. I got a bigger bed, so before I had a twin bed, and now I have a full bed, and I'm so excited. My twin was just very small. I've had it for years. I've had it for so long. Never complained about it because it's fine. It's a bed to sleep on. I'm never going to complain about that, but my parents were like, I feel like you just need a bigger bed, and I was like... I'm not going to complain with that either, so <laughs> my parents got me a bigger bed, and I'm so freaking excited. I actually got this comforter for Christmas, I got the sheets for Christmas, and then obviously like the bed frame because I needed, you know, a new bed because it's a full now. And then also the mattress underneath I got for Christmas as well. I got all this bedding for Christmas, and I'm so excited, and I love it, and I've been sleeping on it, and it's amazing. Okay, so that is all that I got for Christmas. I am so happy with everything that I got, and I wanted to say thank you to all of my family for getting me all this stuff this is actually not like everything it is everything but it's not like everything i'm getting for christmas because my grandma and my mom were actually not feeling great on christmas so we didn't get to have christmas at my grandma's house with my cousins and my grandma so we're actually having christmas this weekend instead but yeah i was gonna push this off until after i got all my stuff from my grandma but i was like you know what i'm gonna go and film it so many people were asking for it i was like it's okay if you guys want to see like all the other stuff i got from my grandma let me know, do you want me to do a haul on my Instagram or TikTok? I can totally do that so you guys can see like what I get from my cousins and my grandma. If you want to see that, just let me know. I'm not sure if this video is going to have comments or not. Sometimes they have comments, sometimes my video does not. I'm hoping it does so you guys can let me know because I have enjoyed commenting back to you guys in the last two videos. They've had comments and I've been so excited because I've got to talk to you guys through them. 
and it's been so amazing. If I do have comments on here, let me know. If I don't, go to Instagram or TikTok or something and let me know. Would you like to see me do a haul of everything I get this weekend? But yeah, I hope you guys did enjoy this video. If you did, make sure you give it a big thumbs up, subscribe down below, and I will see you guys next time. Bye!